Well, good morning, guys. I'm super tired, but it doesn't happen by itself. I finally got the coilover suspension and the rest of the bolts and stuff, so... The trunk is... trunk is full. And my car is full of stuff. Pretty packed. So let's go. out of the car so it's a uh, rear trailing arms brakes front brakes rear brakes PC uh, racing coilovers 51 millimeter struts and my 17 inch wheels ECM wheels AC Snitcher, Replicas Let's see Well, first I need to open the BC Racing box and figure out how to weld the bottoms on the front and I need to blast the rear brackets because the other ones I got wrong, like you saw in the video, so I changed them out, so I need to blast and paint these. Yeah, a lot to do, so let's get cracking. So I just opened the box. So here are the restruts. Rear springs, spring seats, color keys, and the front struts. I need to weld these bottoms to these so I'm gonna take it apart and see what's needed weld it on here I need to cut this and position it, weld it, and they can go together. So it even came with instructions. So I have to cut 50 millimeters. So it's somewhere around there. So 
I'm gonna go cut it and then see what the next step is. So one down, 50 milli millimeters and cut. Now the other. So now I have to clean this up, clean everything up all the way down here and then it should slide over and I'm gonna preheat it and then weld it. So because this doesn't slide super easily on I'm not gonna hit it. I'm gonna try to warm this up and because when it warms up it expands so I can drop it when it's warm on side on top there. Like a glove. So now both are welded, so I'm gonna let them cool down naturally and then clean it up and paint it.
So the front kit from IRP, it comes with a bracket to mount this, but when you take it like this, it doesn't fit the holes. You have to grind off both sides and I'm gonna do that now. So you use this to hold up against here and then you have to get it slowly onto the sleeve. Now it's all the way, then we can start screwing this nut. So now it's all the way and we'll do the final tightening when it's on the car. It's, this is a 36 millimeter and we're going to tighten it 285 newton meters or 210 lips per feet after we put it in the car.
So guys, everything is installed. The braided brake line, calibers, everything. The coilover is just set at some height, nothing special. So, because it's a bit out of the fender, so I'll probably have to roll it so it's a bit high right now, so. And I put the, the right brake caliber brackets on, but I needed to put a washer here. It's like a millimeter thick washer, so it would be in the center, because otherwise it would hit on on the outside here so yeah so that's it for today and this broke like two week ooh, two weeks ago when I drove over some cardboard box on the road and I didn't see it because there was a big car in front of me so I couldn't see anything but I have the piece and I'm gonna try to fix it when I get a new fastener for the lip so that waits but can't wait to do the rear next weekend or something